Uh, what if there was a trophy for keeping all the keys? Then I'd do it. <laughs> I'm th I'm like two, tr two, three trophies away from getting all the trophies in this game. There is no platinum. Don't ask me. I don't know why. Well, gotta use it. Um, use gun. All right. Uh, I have to beat, I have to beat the game under a certain amount of time, like three hours with one save. Only allowed. And that's because the original release of this game had two discs. And the, the one save you're allowed is at that point where, where the, the, the second disc would have been inserted. Oh, thank God. I don't know how close he was, but I need to get out of there. It's five hours and a half. Isn't it? I have no idea. I thought it was three hours. Five hours and a half. Man, if that is it, then this game's so long. Because that seems like way too much time. And the other one I have is later on, it's uh, get advice from Claire. When you temporarily play as Steve. Spoilers. Sorry to disappoint, but yeah. Uh, you, you basically... You, as soon as you start playing as Steve... Just turn around and go back out the door you came in and you get a cutscene and that's it and I missed it so we're gonna do it this time I think we're all right what oh it's Resident Evil time to push some crates it's not crate yeah, it doesn't seem that that uh, doesn't seem like it's all that difficult five and a half hours seems like overkill Hold on. It's a crate puzzle. It's gonna take a while. Hell yeah, look at that. Look at that. Now, I love this game, but I do credit uh, Code Veronica for being the game that jumped the shark. Where Resident Evil before this was all like super serious but cheesy. This game just goes on into like bad, uh, the bad style of cheesiness at times. Christmas is a cutscene in Resident Evil game. That happens a lot in Resi 4. There's like a bunch of optional ones I never got. At least four or five. Fuck. Good job, Claire. You, you shot the wall a mile behind him. I took off his helmet! See why the knife is the preferred weapon? Because I just wasted like 20 shots on that prick. Uh, yeah, Resi 4 has a couple of optional cutscenes I, I usually miss. Oh, fuck. Get to the knife. Yeah, bad dog. Bad dog. Oh, yeah, you know you like it. Any more? Whose ass needs whooping now? Ah, fuck. Fuck! I mean, I didn't hear him walking around, man. You gotta believe me. Navy proof? Proof he's in the Navy? I ask him if he likes sucking dick. Right, I'm only kidding, I'm only kidding. Uh, I actually think people in the Navy are pretty damn crazy. You know, you wouldn't catch me going into a submarine. Fuck that. You gotta have balls of steel to do that. That shit gives out you're you're gonna be you know starving to death or waiting for air to, to go away at the at the damn bottom didn't that happen a couple of years ago in america or something a bunch of poor people in the navy fucking their 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 submarine gave out and they they were, they were just like well we can't do anything you know the government was like we cannot get to them there's no way we can get to them and they all died they just left them there really fucked up crazy job crazy job hell no I'd, I'd rather, if I, you know, I'd rather be in a fighter jet. You know? Less, less fucked up. <laughs> yeah, if, the, if the jet gets shot down, it's only about 30 seconds you have to wait. <laughs> Not a couple of days. Why are y'all bringing the stream down with your fucking negativity? All the sadness. Huh? Huh? Who brought that up? Which one of you started that conversation? I have to start banning people in this chat now. Asking you shall receive. See, that's really fucked up. That's a fucked up thing to say. 
That's that's fucking nasty. You see, you see that shit? You hear what he just said? You hear what he just said? Talking about smothering and shit. Nothing useful. Hey, it's my <laughs> hey, look at it. Where's that? It it's my Twitch chat. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Right, where are we going? Uh, in here. I'd have shot myself if I was in that situation. Oh shit, bats. Oh, I don't got my lighter. Uh. Back, back bats. Be gone with you. No. Okay. We're all good, we're all good. The controls in Resident Evil 4 are crap? How dare you? How dare you? Okay, it was designed for GameCube where the right analog stick was non-existent because that controller was crap. But how dare you? I think you just haven't played Resi 4 in a long time and and you're you're feeling a little, little uh, like it's a little outdated. Resi 4 controls? I mean, it plays exactly like Resi 1 through everything else before that, just with a different camera angle. You know, back when Resi 4 came out, they were they were praising it for uh, for being so up to date and modern compared to the old Resident Evils, these ones. So, are you saying that that uh, time has once again changed it back? Okay, I'm gonna save it because I I don't want to die. I'm ringing them up now. How dare you shit on the GameCube controller? I'm calling the police. There's my old saves. 26. End of the game, man. Hey, don't be looking at that. That's a spoiler. Look away. Look away. Don't let the Smash community hear you talk trash about the GameCube controller. Don't worry, man. They're too busy not taking showers to, to be talking back to me. Uh, let me see. We'll put you in here. We'll put you in here. Put you in here. And, uh... I mean, look at this. Oh my god! It's a simple lock! If I had a lock pick, I could open it! Damn you! Where's Claire when you need her? Wait, no. Jill. We got Claire. Secretary's note! Four years have passed since I began serving Sir Alfred! Oh, my name's Robert! <coughs> <laughs> hey. Hello. What be this? Evidence that the shelf can be moved. Ugh. I mean, isn't that every shelf on the planet that can be moved? How to get there? Like, did you ever buy a shelf and be like, well, I guess it's staying there forever. We can't really move this shelf. Didn't come with instructions. ID card. Ah, the computer downstairs. If only I, I had a simple lock, man. Ah, uh, I just need to pick this shit. Could be the camera angles. Are you trying to move the camera angles with the right analog stick and just like freaking out because you can't do it? I could understand why that would be a problem. Ah! For me, I, I fucking square and X are switched in this game compared to the other ones. Meanwhile, the PlayStation 4 controller is garbage. By the way, Chris, since your dog's dead, now I can get away with talking about how Sony. Uh, our teeth. That makes no sense, but all right. It's all it's all good, man. Almost, almost as good as this game. Look at that little shadows. I I remembered the number of this, but I don't remember it now. Like I I had to fucking, I had it in my head. You don't need this card if you know it. N T C, zero three ninety four. N T Z C fuck. Right, we got it. Calm down. I I uh I forget it. N T C zero three ninety four. Oh yes. <laughs> Open those doors, bitch. I'm coming in with my Mr. Pointy and I'm gonna shove it down some zombie throats. Maybe I should use my gun actually. I, I'm getting a little fucked up. Yeah, I discard it. I don't need that shit.
Claire Redfield. Hey. Hey. You stay back now. Fuck! Thank you! Nice! Didn't waste a single bullet! But my health is really shit in the basket. Hey, Techni Games! Hey, everybody! Techni Games is in the chat! Right, what's down here? Another zombie? Another zombie? Another zombie? It's a zombie. Mr. Zombie! Ah, oh, my face! Hickeys are bad. Make you look ugly. Sit down! Fuck off, dude! Get the f- I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it getting bitten. I'm not wasting ammo when I can stab him to shit. Gold crest, huh? Hey, is this where we meet the, 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 the fucked up twins? Look at all these guns. These aren't models, right? These are real guns. Handguns are displayed here. This is, a, this is one of the dumbest rooms in all of Resident Evil. Ever. Straight up stupid. You got machine guns and magnums and everything on display. Can't use them. Break the glass? No. This is some fucked up shit right here. Brain juice and family. Hey, brain juice. Creepy. I'll up this. Uh, this will be going up on YouTube. Don't worry. Um, bye, Dark Suicide. Enjoy your day, and thanks for the fantastic donation. It uh, blew me away, honestly. So thank you very much, and uh, have a good one. Try to enjoy the summer, dude. Ah, oh, that's enough of that. Yeah. Uh, let's put them back. Man, Techni Games got it on point. He knows Alfred is a weirdo, but we ain't there yet. That's a spoiler. Look at this. Gun from many countries are on display. Real guns. These aren't models. There's nothing indicating it's a model. Claire. Dipshit. <gasps> Hold on. I was wondering what we'd have to do next. We're going to go to the Navy. One of them submarines we were talking about earlier on. Let's get out of here. We all live in a yellow submarine. Shit. Whoa. Alright, that's not funny. Hey. Is that Resident Evil 2 music? Could someone confirm? Is that Resident Evil 2 music? I don't know if I need the... Uh, the Navy crest... Right now, but I'm going to take it anyway. It's better than backtracking all the way back here to get it if I do. So close to the PC parts and switch. Whoa! Yeah, help me! Help me! Steve? No, Steve! I'll save you! I think he made the same mistake I did. Only he's stupid. Where you at, boy? I'm coming. Gotta take care of the baby now. S 
team is suffering. Oh no. What will we do? There's three switches. Ah, shit. B. E. Ah. A. There's no response. What will we do? What will we do? All right. I think there's a puzzle around here. Uh. I think it has to do with the ant. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. All right. Um, get rid of A. Two guns. So is there an extra ant? No. So two warships. No, two guns. Get rid of the ant. Man, Steve, you're just gonna have to stop for a little bit longer. I'm sorry, dude. But you know, just the way things gotta be sometimes. What is that one down there? D? Knife. Was well, they used a knife, didn't they, in the, the video? No? Knife. Wait, did I turn that off back then? No. Right, hold on, we got it, I got it. Two pairs. Operate it. Get rid of D. Get rid of B. A and F again. See now, see they're, they're war, they're war like machines, right? So I'm not, I'm not, I'm a little worried why that's not working. Uh, two pairs. Okay, that's that's a ship and a plane. Is there another plane? There's an ant. Uh, and a D. What? That's a knife, right? What the fuck? Hold on. Knives. Guns. Plane. See, that says model. There's a ship. Two guns. That's a fucking magnum, isn't it? Two magnum. Two magnum. One of you said it hasn't been cleaned in a decade, probably. But still, at the same time, they're behind glass. What dirt is gonna get in there? And you know these rich bastards had them spotless going in. Two guns, right? That's a pair. Uh... A, B, A, D. Am I doing it wrong? Well, obviously I'm doing it wrong. What's the damn answer? Uh, D, A. Two pairs. That's the right one, right? He's gonna die. If, if, if it was possible to kill him here, he'd be dead. It's a magnum and a revolver. But they're handguns, no? Hold on. Hold on. Ah. Uh. I mean, they used it. Why is there a fucking ant there? Aye. Two pairs to complete. Let me read that. There's a message on the control panel. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. Two pairs. The fucking guns. So two guns. I'm I'm fucking going with it. Two guns is one pair. Right? What the fuck's the other pair? A knife and an ant is not a pair. Warplane and ship makes sense to me. I mean both militaries. You know? They're both the boat, um... The boat, the boat used for murder. You know, I can't think of anything... I swear, if the fucking guns, two pair. No, yeah, hold on. Steve is suffering, there's a message on the control panel. 
When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. Two pairs. That's four. Right? That's four. Makes no goddamn sense. Wow. I made it. That was too close. What took you so long? Oh, I need those. Give them to me. Got it. Fine. But let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. I'll see you around, Claire. Adios. Hey, wait, Steve! That made no damn sense. Two pair, two pair. So what was it? It was only the guns on their own. Just the two handguns, which makes one pair. A pair is two. Two pair would be four. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Faster than bullets. Great beast! How dare you interfere with my operation? What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you could lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? You must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. How dare you! The Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inc. Now tell me. Why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. I still don't follow you. I really don't know anything about that. Unacceptable! How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. And thanks to you, the experimental T-Virus was released. Creating countless zombies and monsters. Tell me, who do you work for? Who sent you? <laughs> Have it your way then. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my laugh's not much better. I'm not one to judge. Well, see you later, dude. Very effeminate features. Oh, you have no idea. Give it time. Give it time. But, before Steve interrupted us with that stupid, inaccurate puzzle. Um. Yeah. Where were we going? We were going down here, right? Aha! We got a boat, bitch! Yeah! Popeye that shit! Pretty! I ain't getting in it though. No way in hell would I get in that. That's a giant coffin. Ugh. I mean, if it was this or zombies, and you're trapped on an island, I can see where you're coming from. Uh, anything else in here I should be looking at? Oh shit! Side pack? Side pack this early in the game? No physical difference though? Aw, oh, Resident Evil 3 had physical differences. Some bullshit. 
His laugh is so creepy. Kind of a rude thing to say, don't you think, Techni? Where do we go? We somewhere new? We somewhere fresh? I'll climb the ladder. The guy's posh accent. Uh, keep you up to date with the lore. Well, this takes place after Resi 2. Uh, Claire is looking for her brother and has been kidnapped while infiltrating a facility owned by Umbrella. And basically, all the lore is what's happening in this game right now. So you're going to discover it as you go along. Like this guy over here. Hey, can you explain the story to the viewers, please? They might not be... Oh, that's a zombie! That's a zombie! That's two zombies. Get off! No, don't kill me! I'm dead. <laughs> I had to do that again! I got stingy. I kept the bullets to myself. Fuck. There's two pairs. Two pairs. There. That is one pair, right? That was too close. Shut up. Hey. Hey. Turn around. You killed me last time. That's right. I want you to look me in the eyes when I blow your fucking head off. Your bum chum over there can stay there. He didn't do shit last time. Back, man. Get back. I ain't your friend. And I ain't a cop. I'm not gonna give you another warning. I'm not gonna go for the arrest. Shit. Let's knife him. Why not? Eh. Okay. Sneaky! Uh, uh, never mind, never mind. Nice! Yeah! Gotta get the timing right. Yeah! Ah, oh, suck it! Suck it! You see that? That's how you do it over here. Man, if the knives were useful in the other Resident Evil games, could you imagine that? That's one of the best things they did. Uh, okay, see, bye, well, and enjoy your day, man. Ah, oh, fuck, fuck. I need to get my, my goddamn shit back. Get out of my way, dickhead. If you have the lighter, they don't bother you. My liar's all the way back at that damn metal detector. Get lost! What a dick thing to do. Got messed up by bats. To this day, I'll never understand how all these soldiers who were trained specifically for this kind of shit died so damn early or easily. Um, you know, you bring up a good point. Especially when you consider what one machine gun can do to a bunch of zombies. But you know, at the same time, it's kind of a domino effect. One guy gets bitten, then uh, another guy is going to get bitten, and before you know it, you know, it's, it's like, it's, it's not just anything can in infect you. Scratches, you know? It's not like a bullet to the chest. Ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. If a zombie like carves you with his nails while he grabs you, you're probably going to get infected. Oh, fuck. I know this area. Hey, it's a control panel for the shutter. The markings above the keyhole read K402. The knife runs would be so much better. Yeah, like as I was saying, that's one of the best things about the future resis. Is that we don't have to uh, worry about the knife being useless. Because it's, one, doesn't take up a place in the inventory. And it's really damn good. Um, do I not use this yet? I don't think I use this yet. Nah, we don't use this yet. Okay, can I get out of this? May I please get out of this? Thank you very much. It's good to be polite. 
someday the robots will have AI and it'll be really mean if you're if you're going to be rude to them. The lever's missing. The lever's missing? Damn. Maybe I do have to use it here. This is also the the place who turned out hunk. You think they'd have top notch uh soldiers? I mean you got a good point. Yeah, I, I don't really got a defense for that. Other than, you know shit got lucky. I mean if you think about it if you think about it, Hunk's survival was rather was rather luck based. William just didn't fuck him up, right? Ah, oh, come on, dude. Am I doing it wrong? Like, he was a survivor because Hunk didn't fuck him. Uh, William missed him or something. I don't know why he was doing the sewer. In fact, the fourth survivor thing doesn't make much sense to me. Because... In, in, please work. Thank you. The hunk is the hunk and his friends are the reason the outbreak starts, right? So, but at the beginning of Four Survivor, hunk has hunks like laying face down in the dirt, and then you go upstairs, and and the entire vicinity is covered in zombies. How long was he face down in water? Without drowning, unconscious. Hey, Mr. Zombies! That's a lot of enemies, man. That's a lot of enemies. Can I leave? Can I leave? That's a shit ton of enemies. Ah, shit. Alright. Alright, we got this. Please, leave me the hell alone. This is Resident Evil 3 music, right? When they're smashing through the TV station. Yeah, this is Resi ah! ah! No! No! This is Red Needle 3 music. Reload! Shoot faster! Who else? Oh god! Legless man! The most powerful zombie of them all! Ah no! My knees! That's where my nips are! That's all good. I'm fucked, dude. Damn. Shit, better be worth it. Damn, I got messed up. Hunk was out cold for at least a week. If the timeline is to be believed. Yeah! What the fuck? It's a gaming storyline. Mm-hmm. Like game and physics. I mean that's that's really where it comes down to, isn't it? Yeah, Michael got it right. Maybe longer. Since the, uh it's the rats that spread the virus. Yeah, it make make no goddamn sense. Um What's this for and where? A card key is shining in silver. Military training facility. Military training facility. Hmm. I'm gonna. I have a, a suspicion of where I have to go, but I'm not. We'll, we'll figure it out. Leave me alone, bats. You all stay down there. Keep your ass away from me. I spoke about this with Del May Cry One, but this is the other game that. I always think of Offspring and and um, what's the other one? Offspring and uh, Lincoln Park when I play it because when I got this game I got this game for Christmas and it came with the Devil May Cry 1 demo which I played a shit ton of because I was too afraid to play this game and my sister we were like 10 my sister got the uh, Linkin Park CD when they came out with In The End and whatnot, And she had that CD on blast all day while I was playing this. 
So now when I hear in the end this game and Del May Cry play in my head. And when I'm playing this game, uh, Del May Cry, not yeah, Del May Cry and uh, Lincoln Park play in my head. But also Crazy Taxi because it was also around this time that I, um, it was also around this time that I got Crazy Taxi, and you know I played them all around, uh, basically taking breaks from each other uh, throughout the week. So Offspring for Crazy Taxi due to the soundtrack. But also because I played him the same day as this, and my sister was listening to Linkin Park the entire time. I knew it! Chris is an edgelord that listens to Linkin Park. They have some good songs! Especially on their first two albums. I mean, you have to be in the right mood to listen to it. But they have some good songs, how dare you! Okay, I don't, I don't know where... I don't... I'm gonna take a risk and assume I have to go down this way. But I'm not sure. 